Hello, I'm going to do a for me. Last little bit of roofing dismantled. Cleaning up this little area here behind the breeding tent. I've got a fire going over there on the other side, burning some of this. Hopefully we won't get any more rain today and we'll be able to do some more burning. We're starting to separate these piles, separate the wood into piles that is going to be made into uh, cooking wood. Uh, Ging Ging and uh, one of her associates have agreed to do the cooking wood. so. Uh, they'll start on that next week. This year, it's supposed to be burned. That there needs to be trimmed out. There's more cooking wood here, more little spits. The consensus is just to take that bamboo down. And uh, I think uh, Tata and Gina have a plan for it because it'll make a fence somewhere. These bananas are coming back, amazingly enough. So the plan now is to save that little uh, portion of the fattening pins there or Peppa, uh, just to repair that part of the roof, and because that's the best pin available for. There's a already a cooling pool in there. We're gonna go tomorrow and get some rice holes to put in there for, and make that a, a better little home. All right, well we. Got a bunch of this ablaze here. Most of it's still too uh, wet to really burn well, but uh, as each day passes, it'll it'll get to where it'll burn better and better. I'll come through in the morning and rake this stuff a little bit, turn it over, and uh, noonish time. Uh, after it's dried out a bit more, do it all again. I've set, I don't know, half a dozen or more fires just getting this stuff started. It's kind of looking like apocalypse now around here, all these, all this smoke, but uh, it's it's got to be started. Uh, all the stuff in this pile here is still too green. That's why I didn't light this off. But we've got several, several spots going here. get all that 
10 moved. Some of it salv salvageable, some not. We'll see what the guys are doing down here. Well, this is what, this is our antenna modem for the Wi-Fi. Uh, this is what ripped right, ripped these, ripped these right out of the back of the unit. So I'm glad we were able to find this. The, the tin that was right in here was from the roof, uh, the center of the roof. And when it went, it just ripped those plugs right out of the back of the Wi-Fi. Well, there's Gina's planter. <laughs> All right, we got this area here cleaned out. And started fires. We got this set aside here for cooking wood. What can you say, Tate? Very hot. Very hot. No shade. No shade. Maybe two to three years we have to say. That's a long time for no shade, Tate. Yeah. <laughs> mulberry tree here is still alive and growing. I think there's one right underneath that pile that's going to get burned there. But we're not going to move all this brush again. And if it's underneath that pile, it's dead anyway. I just go stick it in the flame over there.
All right, well, it doesn't look like it, but we actually got a lot done today. We got a lot of wood moved, a lot of wood burned. Got that old pin torn down, mostly. All this area in here around Tata and Gina's new house was cleared. <coughs> All that tin back up in there by the round tanks was cleared. I did a lot of burning today. Uh, it's still, you know, green wood, so not much other than the leaves burned, but that fire will dry out uh, the, the wood that much faster. We've got, I don't know, a dozen piles like this set aside for cooking wood. good progress this week. It was a week of good progress. The piggery roof was dismantled and the tin saved, the wood saved, the tin that was savable. The chicken coop was taken down, uh, some around the fattening pens was taken down. Uh, a lot was done. A lot of cleaning up around the house. And around here, this new chicken pen was put in, and a lot accomplished in a week. Hopefully next week will be just as productive. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.